Yes, we're back. We're back again in Learner Trucker. We're back again to take off those training wheels. It's time to buy our first truck. I'm going to take out a loan and you've probably seen by the thumbnail what it is. Let's go old school. Grab that guidebook to old Scanners in the ETS2 and let's go. So yeah, hi there, Steve here. Welcome back to Learner Trucker. Lesson number 16, I think this is. And yes, uh, I think it's time to stop going around in other people's trucks. I think it's time to do our own truck. And before we can do that, we got to take out a loan because we've only got 36,000 in the bank. So let's go to our friendly neighborhood bank manager or we'll take out a uh, hundred thousand euro loan that gives us a nice healthy bank balance now of 136,000 and we're going to go to the mod dealer because we've got the RJL mod installed and uh, we're going to go R series so we're going to go R4 um, which we're going to go normal cab 4x2 chassis Engine, yes, we're going to go 220 horsepower. Yeah, yeah, that's definitely a thing. Uh, gearbox, I'm not going to stick with an 8-speed. I'm going to have to go 12-speed um, for my sanity. Uh, interior, look how glorious that is. That is just wow. Um that's awesome um, color wise we're gonna stick with that we're not gonna do anything to this truck at all accessories look at all those dots look at them that's flipping awesome and the dots we can put inside as well so we're gonna do a few upgrades to this truck as we go along and then I think this is gonna have to go to our other driver um, but 117 119,000 with the paint job uh, that's the truck we're gonna buy and we've only got one garage, haven't we? Which is back in Birmingham. So that's where we're going to have to put it. So yes, new truck. So we're back in Birmingham. So let's have a look at the uh, job market. Um, we'll have a look at external. See what we can do from Birmingham then. Birmingham to Dover. Well, that gets back across to the continent, wouldn't it? Let's do that. Some wooden beams. Birmingham to Dover. 256 miles in our brand new truck. So, yeah, I was going to carry on doing some more jobs, um, but thought it would take another probably 15, 20 videos uh, to be able to do that. So, um, I thought, well, why not? Let's uh, look at that. I'm going to have to go into Photo Studio and take a picture of that, aren't I? In all its glory, our first truck. There we go. There's our screenshot. Right. So, never driven it. Obviously, just bought it. Let's pop some lights on. So a whopping 220 horsepower. What would you do, Darde? Uh, Unpause track IR. Okay, pop it in gear. I'm sure we can cope with second. But it sounds like the normal. I'll probably put that game audio up a little tiny bit more. There we go. Sounds like a normal truck. Turn left. So we're in the UK. Keep left and then turn left. So we've got to make our way back across to the continent turn then. Left. Which this will do it. 
So 220 horsepower. This is going to be a struggle. To keep right and then turn right. Okay, the indicators. Turn okay. right. Come on. Yeah, a whopping 220 horse. But we've got our first truck. I did say it was going to be a Scania, but thanks to uh, Captain Chaos reminding me of the uh, RJLs, right, and then turn right. And he did say that there was an old RJL as well. Turn right. You wouldn't start out necessarily in a brand new truck, would you? And uh, you would buy something. You have arrived at your destination. Second hand. Your route guidance is now finished. So let's uh, back under it and see how ridiculous this tiny little thing looks. Oh, it's a struggle. It's going to be a struggle. Right, I think that's going to have to be a, uh, a thumbnail moment. Just about there. Why right, should we go back into photo studio? Forever the professional. We'll see, I do this while I'm recording the video. Um... Yeah, it's going to be that in that. There we go. Right, onwards. Oh, it doesn't like putting off in second. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Oh, it's going to be interesting getting this thing back on the continent. I'm going to have to go first gear, aren't I? Sorry, truck, but I'm going to have to pull out in front of you. With my whopping 220 horsepower. Okay, I might actually have to single shift the gears in this. I might be alright once I get going, actually. A whole 33 miles an hour. But well, we're in our first truck. And that's pretty cool. Even if it has got 220 horsepower. Keep right and then continue straight on. Go straight on. Okay, fourth gear as we enter the motorway at 12 miles an hour. We 
they should all be uh, motorway now. Right up into ninth, doing 27. We're on a slight incline as well. Go straight on. I'm not going to go into services. Last point, fuel. Now we've got four tank of fuel. We're okay. This thing ain't going to be the most uh, fuel efficient, pulling heavy loads. All right, going for tenth. We actually get to the speed limit, that's the thing. Oh, 11th. Well, the good thing is, now we've got this truck. Again, depending on uh, what way. I'm going to go. Um, we're going towards London, aren't we? So we'll get down that lane. Is um, I said I keep going with this series until I got my second driver. So now we got to make enough money to not only cover the loan, but also to go straight on. Be able to um, get a second driver. Eight seems to be our limit. We're going over here now, aren't we? Oh, no, not yet. Exit left. Just when I got a bit of a. bit of speed building up. So the RGL. Uh, is in the Steam Workshop. So we'll keep getting updated automatically. That's why I do like adding the DLCs from Steam. Right, the acceleration begins again. I'm on the M1 now. Oh my god, I'm, it's a truck sandwich. Tenth. Into eleventh. Oh, police going past. Don't want to have to overtake this thing now. I didn't think I'd be doing that. Alright, let's go into twelfth then. First time I've been in twelfth gear. I actually have to back off because of that truck. Tired this thing, I don't know. Seems to be yawning away now for the next 187 miles. I need to make sure I turn that off. Go straight on. Okay, we're not quite doing 50, but it's going okay. My foot is flat to the floor. But I really like this. That's we've got to change down for a hill. 
Oh, that's the sign of not a lot of power, isn't it? Change down for a hit on a motorway. My driver's tired, but I've got to get this load down. So yeah, do you think I made the right choice? Is this the right truck? Uh, I did hint that I would be going Scania. So uh, always knew that this was going to be a thing, but I didn't think I'd be going... I thought I'd be going new S-Line. I didn't think I'd be going awesome old school Scania. The being RJL, as we saw, it's got lots of dots. So what do we do? Do we keep this stock um, and then just keep, I just keep plodding away in this until I can afford to give this another driver. And then um, I get myself something new. Or do we uh, stick with this truck and continue on? because we got to get back down to where we were on the map really because I wanted to go and explore Pro Mods but we had to start back in Birmingham because that's the only garage we had I'm not going to be able to afford to buy a garage for a while got 8th gear up on the motorway gear up a hill <laughs> the queue of traffic behind me oops Twenty miles an hour on the M1. Oh, even that switch sounded nice. Right, we're accelerating again. I think. It could be. Oh yeah, we are. A lot of Warburton's vans. Oh, we got to come off up here. Keep left, and then exit left. God, yeah, I'm getting tired now. Exit left. Turn left. Well, I've got 140 miles to go. Hopefully now, we can get a bit of speed up. We're doing 56. Holy crap. We Keep want to right. crash into an ambulance. Wouldn't be ideal. Wow, he left that to the last minute. So at these speeds, it's absolutely fine. a lot of 
signs. So yeah, 220 horse on the motorway, not a problem. On a hill, Keep problem. Right. Around town, problem. But yeah, here, avoid sleeping offence. What? Oh, guy's going to keep doing me now, isn't it? Well, I can't sleep here, can I? Because my job's going to be late then. I can't really afford to have too many fines. I haven't got that much money in the bank. Nowhere to pull over. <sighs> but yeah, on the motorway, it's fine. Okay, we slow down a bit to 50 now. But it's cruising along quite nicely. I didn't even look at the weight of the, uh, the load I was pulling. I just saw something that was uh, heading to a port. So at least next time we can get ourselves back across to the continent. But really liking this. I should be uh, happy in this for a while. Hughes likely. Caution. Please mind the speed limit. Right, over QE2 bridge, I'm guessing this is supposed to be. Speeding offence. Oh, crap. Avoid sleeping offence. Oh, God. Money's going down now. Sorry, car behind me. I'm going to have to cut you up slightly. Welcome to Kent. I know I'm getting tired. Oh, just dummy again. Oh, toll. Well, I've got 70 miles to go. At this rate. Keep left, and then exit left. If I find somewhere to pull over, I'm going to have to pull over, I think. That's why I turn off that um, fatigue thing. Exit left. Keep left. Exit now. Oh, it doesn't like putting off in second. Fifty-seven miles to go. And it's going really well. I am impressed. Uh, you know, I had to go for the 220, didn't I? It had to be a thing. Um, 
Yeah, I do like an underpowered truck, but blimey, Charlie. And it probably costs more to buy this than it would have cost me to buy a 360 Scania S, but this is just so much nicer, isn't it? Proper gauges. I'm going to take a screenshot of that. That is just so nice. Folks in Andover, straight on. <sighs> do me for a speeding offence again now. Well, I would stop if I could find somewhere to stop. I would stop. I'm going to have to rest. I think after this journey. You're just on the cusp of that. You can just about hear that lovely turbo whistle. Right. Oh, hello, that's not good down there. Yeah, that's probably not an ideal scenario. Having a car upside down. really happy with my truck so it's up to you what we uh, what we do do I carry on with this stock and then uh, give it to my uh, driver what no 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 oh, I hate it when it does that I haven't passed anywhere to stop. I can't stop. So yeah, do I keep this stock? Uh, don't do anything to it. Drive it in 220 basic form and then give it to my driver as is. Or do I progress and um, Tweak it, tune it, do it up, make it look good, add lots of accessories on it, and see how great we can get this thing looking. It's up to you. I've recorded this a couple of weeks in advance. Um, Keep left, and then turn left. <sighs> so I will wait before recording the next one until I can read your comments on this one. Turn left. Oh, don't do it. A set of flipping traffic lights. All right, so we've only got two miles to go to drop our load off. Keep left. And there we go, the end is in sight. Ah, I've discovered a recruitment agency, so at least I can take on a drive when I have to. it's done well it's quite a heavy load we've pulled truck's done well only crashed because I fell asleep 
Like that. Oh, for God's sake, don't do that. Just sound the brakes on. Get ready to turn right. Yeah, I will just turn, turn off that right. fatigue simulation. Right, out onto the A2. Okay. Are you going to stop? You're turning. Okay. Come on. That must have been a slight incline because I couldn't get it going in first. I can't find a parking spot. I haven't parked. Oh, those! No! Oh. No, 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 no! No, 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 no! Oh, Jesus Christ, the bloody panic. Keep right and then turn left. Turn left. Okay, our end point is here. We've made it. Get ready to turn right. Turn right. Man, fine. So I've got to turn off that stupid fatigue thing. You have arrived at your destination. Your route guidance is now finished. Right. That's uh, where do we need it? Because we need the XP now. Oh, if I can actually get it moving. Don't doze when I'm trying to flip and pull off. Okay, I can't actually get the thing moving now. I haven't got the power to go forward. Right, which means I'm going to have to go. Oh, flipping fine. So I'm going to have to back out onto the road. Okay, onto the flat, hopefully. I couldn't pull off up that slope. Right, they want it in there. Okay. Oh, for God's sake. There we go. Wooden beams delivered. We made it to level six. That's something, I suppose. Right, so we've got all the top line. Now we're going to start adding some long distance in. Oh, we didn't do 
the top line, did we? All by the top line. Let's take that out. I did say I'd do them one at a time. There we go. Right, so let's go back to the... Um... Don't doze in the flipping yard. Let's nip back into uh, Dover and then rest up. Obviously, I can't buy a garage. It's going to be interesting to see where I can start from next time. Hopefully, I can just save it and it will carry on from here. Ooh, that's some braking. Right, so there's our garage. Cute. You're just going to stop there. That's really nice of you. Used to be able to change gear quickly. I've turned the game audio down, by the way, if you're wondering why you can't hear the engine. Because of that stupid music that comes up really loud. No! Don't doze at this speed! Oh, Jesus Christ! I know I'm tired. I haven't passed a single place where I could stop. Apart from that one. Now I'm going to go to the repair garage just down here. And, uh... And then rest. that way, find this way. Oh, that does. You could you could clearly could wait thirty more seconds. Oh, for God's sake. Stupid steam notifications back as well. Uh, right. Right. Uh, yes, all right. I get you're tired. There we go. Finally, he's rested. Um, but we will leave him there to carry on resting. Yeah, don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I'm about to go and turn off the anti-fatigue thing now. Um, it's up to you uh, what we do. I won't record the next one until after this one's been released. Um, so do we carry on in the standard, excuse me, stock 94L220? Do you want to see me trauma my way around Europe with no power? Uh, and then give this to another driver and then maybe carry on uh, and work my way up uh, in the same truck, I think, but then upgrade it. Um, or do I upgrade this and then move on to another truck or then buy my driver at the base one? It's up to you. Leave a comment below and I'll record the next video after this has been released. Uh, don't forget to check out my other content, which is Omzi the Bus Simulator on a Monday, Taurus Bus on a Wednesday, Fern Bus on a Friday, this goes out on a Saturday and uh, other content as well. And do please check out the Discord server, a link to which I'll leave in the description below. I'll leave my man sleeping there. Until the next time then, if you have been, thanks very, very much for watching.